so much for stopping by. If you are new here, welcome. What's up? My name is Autumn. I'm a professional makeup artist of five years based in the Washington DC area. In addition to doing makeup, I am a newly licensed cosmetologist and I am on the admissions team at the Paul Mitchell School in Annapolis, Maryland. I'm super excited to be right where I am right now. So thank you guys so much for being here with me today. As you guys can see by the title and you saw by the intro, I am taking you guys behind the scenes on my most recent photo shoot with Ultimate Face Cosmetics. Shout out to you, Alice. Thank you so much for inviting me. I had an absolutely amazing time. And big shout out to Luigi at Capital Bombshell. Check them both out. I will link all of their details down below. So yeah, at this photo shoot, you guys can see it was a really good time. It was a two day photo shoot and we just had a great time playing with Ultimate Face. Um, products. There was a lot of Paul Mitchell products. For those of you who don't know, Ultimate Face is the professional makeup line that they stock your kit with when you enroll in the Paul Mitchell schools. So in addition to receiving your professional Paul Mitchell kit, you receive a professional makeup artist kit by Ultimate Face. Now, when I first received this Ultimate Face kit, I was like, what the heck is Ultimate Face? I'd never heard about it before. I've been working in and out of Sephora and Ulta's for like two or three years and I had never heard of the brand and I was like, hmm, what's this brand about? And the brand continues to blow my mind. I have several products that are staples in my kit and I'm excited to show you all the new products that I will be adding to my kit. Thanks to you, Alice. Thanks for all the goodies. I appreciate you so much. So yeah, in addition to showing you guys the newest Ultimate Face products in my kit, I just got the most exciting package yesterday. If you guys are following me on Instagram, then I guess it was last year in September. For the Behind the Chair show, I was booked by a brand called Alpha Parf Milano. Maybe you've heard of them. I was booked to be their lead makeup artist, so I got to work with all of the models that were featured on stage along with all the models that were just there for the convention. So it was a really, really cool experience and it was so much fun. But one of the women on the Alpha Park team, we got to talking and she told me that she had actually been working for Lorac a couple years back. And she was like, yeah, I have all these Lorac products that I've literally never used. And I was like, I'll take them. <laughs> and so we kind of lost touch after that, but then Literally a month ago, she reached out to me again and was like, hey girl, remember when I told you I had all those Lorac products? Well, I still do, do you want them? And I was like, yes, I still want them. Um, I absolutely love Lorac. Lorac was one of my favorite brands in store when I was working in store in Ulta. And I was just so excited when my package arrived yesterday. I've already unpacked it. My heart stopped yesterday when I got this package. I'm so excited to show you guys what I got. Thank you, Betsy. Oh my gosh, you are absolutely amazing. So much love to you. I love new products and I'm so excited to share them with you guys. Lorac, I don't even know if Lorac is still a brand, um, but Lorac, if you're still out there, hit me up if you wanna work together. Um, but yeah, without further ado, you guys, let's jump into these Ultimate Face products. Now, the first product that I'm going to show you guys is one of my absolute favorites. It's the all-time staple in my kit. And when I start to run low on this, I honestly start to have a panic attack because it is my favorite product. This is the Ultimate Face Transformer Primer. You guys, this primer has changed the way I do makeup. When I started working for Stila back in, gosh, I don't even know when I was working for Stila, but when I started to work for Stila, I got really heavy into color correcting as a big technique that I was using. They have a primer that is a color correcting primer. This was a huge product for me. It helped me improve my speed. It did a lot for me in my kit and I was using it a lot. So when I found this product, I was like, oh my gosh, this is absolutely amazing. So what I do now is I mix my color correcting shades in here um, and I just apply their base as I would. And you guys, this product is life-changing. It's great for cleaning up fallout. It's great for just priming the skin. And like I said, it's great for kind of mixing with higher pigment products to create more of a custom 
foundation, tinted moisturizer, literally whatever you need. This product is absolute bay. Love her. So moving right along, one of the main focuses of the photo shoot was to highlight the Marula Oil lip products that Ultimate Face has. And let me tell you guys, this is the little Marula Oil Bomb. I think it's so cute and so chic. It's just a little black lip balm. It's not tinted, but it, it does look pink. But let me tell you guys, this product has been saving my life with the weather changing, it being cold now, the heat being on. I have really bad allergies. I have two cats and I'm allergic to both of them. So I do a lot of nose blowing and this has absolutely saved my upper lip from getting like disgustingly chapped from blowing my nose. I don't know if that's TMI, but it's just been an absolutely amazing product for me. The other Marula oil product is more of a gloss. This is my personal one. I'm not putting this in my kit. I just wanted to mention it. It's absolutely amazing. Very hydrating, very restorative. Love, love, love this, you guys. Moving on to two other products that I'm super excited to add to my kit. These are the Ultimate Face Defining Waxes. Now there's one, it's like a black shade. It's called Ninja. And then this one, it's like a warmer, um, brown shade, it's called Mink. These are amazing. What I do with these is I just run a little spoolie through and you know, fill the brow in. It gives you a soft brow, not too structured, but full at the same time. I've been loving doing my brows like this and when I'm working with larger bridal parties or when I am working with clients that just kind of want more of a natural brow and not really that Instagram brow, these are absolutely amazing. So I'm really, really excited to add these to my kit. Cannot wait. I also received a lot of lip products. I received a good amount of pencils. These are double-ended pencils. I absolutely love double-ended pencils because they save room in your kit. So these pencils are really great. Um, they're very pigmented. Love, love, love these pencils. They also are a little bit more on the waxy side. So I find that they keep my lipstick really in the lines of my lip. These are great because they're interchangeable, right? Like. You can use them on the lips, you can use them on the eyes. So this is nice for, I've got a black, I've got like a navy. So these are gonna be really fun to play with. And then I got a lot of, so I got two liquid lipsticks. This one's cute because it's got more of a sheen to it. And this one is the one that I'm wearing today. You guys know if you follow me on Instagram, I absolutely love a red lip. It's my favorite, it's so classic. Timeless, perfect, love a red lip. And then these two fun lip glosses. I haven't seen what this one looks like. It's just a gold, but I used to have so many people come in to Ulta and ask me for like a gold shimmery lip gloss. And I just could never really find one. I mean, there are a lot, but there aren't, if that makes sense. And this guy is more of like, I know it looks white, but it's more of like a pinky, iridescent. It's a really, really pretty shade. So this liquid lipstick, I wore it last weekend to my mom's birthday dinner. I ate a super greasy dish and my lips stayed on all night. I mean, my sister, I kept asking my sister because now that we're wearing face masks, I haven't been wearing lips in such a long time. So I kept asking my sister, like, are my lips okay? Are my lips okay? And I literally, she, she was just like, stop asking. They look fine. So great liquid lipstick. You guys know that when I worked for Stila, I was a huge Beso wearer. This is slightly different to Beso. It's not the same shade. It's a little lighter, but I really like it. And I just love how it wears, I really do. I should probably fill in my like lip butt. Mm -hmm. So yeah, love this you guys. Let me know if I have lipstick on my teeth because I might. The last Ultimate Face product that I wanna show you guys is this guy right here. It's the Double Effect Powder in Copper Lame, and I'm wearing it today. Now, this probably is going to be a little too warm for my lighter skinned friends. Um, if you wanted to like really contour, I would probably use something a little cooler than this. However, this is great for like my medium complected friends, or if you're a little deeper and you just wanna use this all over as like a setting powder, if this matches your complexion, that would be great. I've also used it all over my lids at one point. I've used it, you know, in my crease. There's so many ways that you can use this shade. Um, so I'm excited to add it to my collection. I really don't have a shade this, tone in my collection. So I'm very, very excited to add it to my kit. 
So moving right along, those are all the Ultimate Face products that I have to show you guys, and we are going to move right into the Lorac products. I'm so excited about this, you guys, because I haven't worked with Lorac products in forever, and we've got a lot to show you. I mean, like, hold on one second. I told you guys, we have a lot. Okay, 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 I'm really excited. I didn't open any of them um, just because I wanted to wait till I was on camera, but unfortunately I couldn't wait to open the box because I was just like, oh my gosh, this is a huge box. I wonder what's inside. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna do lips first just because there are a lot of lips to cover. Um, so first things first, oh, this is so nostalgic for me because it really makes me think of my Ulta days when I would clean the Lorac gondola and swatch all the lipsticks and I probably still have a couple of rock lipsticks that um, I'm just obsessed with. Love the packaging, all black, literally my soul. So we have two of the Alter Ego bullets. You guys can see they're more of a satin finish. These are probably some of the most comfortable lipsticks that I've ever worn. This one's really pretty. I don't know if I, am I gonna swatch these? I guess I I don't think I'm going to, guys. I just can't be, cannot be bothered to swatch these. I just, if you guys give this video a thumbs up, maybe I'll apply all these lip colors on my Instagram story. I love this too, because you can see the shade at the bottom. These are like my favorite things. And they smell, mm, they smell like vanilla. I remember, oh my gosh, these are bringing back such good memories. It's like a raisin color, how pretty. Uh, now see, that looks a little bit more orange, doesn't it? Mm. Oh my gosh, I love them so much. And again, I don't even know if Lorac is still a thing. I think they are, but I haven't seen them much. So Lorac, hit me up if you wanna uh, work together. <laughs> Just kidding, I'm not kidding. Um, so yeah, those two. And now what are these? So these guys, these are the Pro Satin Lip Color. I think it's the same as those. The Pro Satin Lip Color, however, these are in the retractable shade. Ooh. Look at this mocha, look at that shade. Interesting, these don't smell like the other ones. So that's the shade mocha, this is the shade sangria. We've also got grapefruit, this is grapefruit. Ooh, that's really pretty, it's like a pinky. So pretty, obsessed with those, moving right along. Moving right along, I have three lip kits, you guys. These lip kits, I remember selling these when I was in Ulta. Now, I don't know if that grosses some of you guys out because you're like, ew, that's gross. Like, they're so old, but like, in the package, not opened, you would probably find these at freaking Marshalls if you went there. These are like a lighter shade. You guys can see these guys. And then these, oh my gosh, obsessed with these. These are that same alter ego lipstick, like little bullet that smells super good. I bought, I'm pretty sure I bought these as a gift actually for Christmas presents. So I'm super excited to have them for um, myself. Okay, and then we have a couple more of the retractable penny sticks. Oh, guys, I'm so excited for these. Um, I don't think, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Maybe I'll give, maybe I'll give these away because I definitely am not going to wear those. Um, but these are going straight in the kit. Absolutely love those. Okay, okay, okay. Moving right along to the fun stuff. So these are all eyeshadows. No, 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 ooh, we've got some eyeliners. You guys, I love using eyeliners to create um, soft wing liner moments. There is a blue shade, a purple shade, and a gold shade. So, so pretty. Very excited to have these. I'm going to throw them in my kit right away and I cannot wait. Moving right along, we have another little Lorac product. This is an eyeshadow palette. I love Lorac eyeshadow palettes. I like it. I like it a lot. This is gonna be mine. So cute. I love this. I'm keeping this for myself and you can't tell me anything. Look how sweet it is. It's so cute. Okay, moving along. So the last things I wanna show you are these eyeshadows that I will definitely be adding to my kit. I don't know if you guys remember when Lorac came out with these. I do. Um, these are the um, unzipped palettes. Um, there are different shades. So this is the Ocean Sunset one. This kind of gives me like Natasha Denona vibes. Anybody else? Um, Wow, that's crazy. This is the mountain sunset one. Speaking of mountains, I watched this movie last night with my husband about a bear and like this guy and girl like going camping. And I literally said to my husband, I'm never 
going camping with you. The guy got like destroyed by the bear. The girl like made it out alive at the very end, but like you won't catch me camping. Ooh, I forgot you guys. All of Lorac's little eyeshadow palettes always come with primers. I forgot about that, oh my gosh. Don't really wear eyelid primers and to be completely honest, I don't know if I love primers like Lorac's. You know, it's more of like a liquidy eyelid primer and I'm just like, they're not my favorite. However, I love that Lorac's products come with primers. I think that's a great deal. Um, so this is the last palette that I have. It's the Desert Sunset palette and it looks like this. Ooh, this one's really pretty too. Let me know if you guys like this form of video. I'm trying to stay really true to who I am as a content creator. I don't love like creating traditional YouTube type like beauty guru stuff like because I am more of a professional makeup artist rather than like a YouTube makeup artist. Um, but just let me know. I'd love to hear you guys' um, feedback in the comment section down below. Right, you guys, so those are all the products I had to show you. These are all going into my kit. I'm going to probably depot these little palettes and put them into my Z palettes along with the lipsticks. I'm definitely going to depot those and throw them into my lipstick palette. I think that's it. I don't have anything else for you guys. If you guys did enjoy this video, please give a thumbs up. It really lets me know that you're enjoying the content that I'm creating. And if you guys wanna join my YouTube family, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And if you wanna be notified every time I upload a new video, go ahead and hit the bell right next to the subscribe button. If you guys are interested in working with me, me, if you are interested in booking me as a makeup artist, a hairstylist, literally anything beauty related, I'm kind of like your own personal beauty advisor, definitely email me through my Instagram. I kind of have a system of how I like to answer my inquiries. And as much as I love your DMs, I really struggle to keep up with them. So feel free to shoot me an email on Instagram. But other than that, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I can't wait till next week's vlog. It's all about the holidays and what I've been getting up to this holiday season. I'm gonna be decorating with you guys. We're gonna be baking cookies and we're gonna be celebrating the holidays. So until next time, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys very soon. Bye-bye. Next time on Autumn Estelle.